Hello everybody, today is uh, March 1st, 2018. <sighs> I have so much stuff to talk about right now, it's like crazy. Um, right now I'm at my boyfriend's place. Okay, so today I stepped on the scale and if I remember correctly, I was completely naked. I almost said naked. Naked. I was completely naked, and it said I was 273.4. Um, it's gotten higher than that lately, uh, but I have so much to tell you guys. Okay, sorry, let's get into it. Number one, not necessarily in this order, but I'm going to talk in the order of things happening that as I realize things happening, whatever. Um, I came in, or not I came in, I'm sorry. Oh, gosh. I, I'm so out of it. I'm so sorry. Let's get this right. Um, a little more than a week ago, actually, just under two weeks ago or so, I would more like a little more than a week ago, whatever, um, I was spending the night uh, with my boyfriend, and I woke up, and I felt my belly and stuff and how fat it was and whatever, and I was just like... I can't do this anymore. Like, what the hell am I doing? I need to go ahead and get weight loss surgery. I'm going to go ahead and go back to meat, and I'm going to go ahead and have weight loss surgery. In fact, this might, this was knocking on two weeks ago, something like that. So I made that decision right there to um, go back to meat and to have weight loss surgery. I was going to have a vertical sleeve gastrectomy. Well, I went back to meat I want to say on the night of February 20th going into the 21st and how I did it was through eating um, these, I one of my favorite foods back when I was a meat eater were buffalo wings. And since I've been back to eating meat, which I am officially back to eating meat, um, I'm mostly sticking to poultry. That's my favorite. Um, like turkey sandwiches and chicken wings and that kind of thing, you know. Uh, yesterday and today, I finished this one cheeseburger I had uh, that I got from this place called Timmy Chan's. It's this um, fast food Chinese place we have down here in Texas, and uh, left something to be desired. But in a weird way, it was kind of good cold. I don't know, but I I don't want to eat too much beef, so or pork or whatever. Um, speaking of, hold on, that's the boyfriend. Hold on. Hey, baby. Okay, well, you still got to come in because <laughs> you got to lock the door. Bring your ass in here. <laughs> I'm doing a video too, but come in. <laughs> Mwah. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> such a dork okay let's get back to it so I decided to get BSG I went back to eating meat the whole night right then something else happened uh within days I realized my period hadn't come I talked to my boyfriend about it and um he didn't really have too much to say about it really um but, you know, I kept, but because it's happened in the past before, you know, where I would miss my period, uh, or not miss my period, I'm sorry, I have not missed a period that I can remember at all in the past several years, but I've had delayed periods, right, um, where maybe I was like a week or so late, whatever, so the difference was I'd been very sexually active and not using protection with my boyfriend, <laughs> so like that's the difference, but okay, let's get to the point. It got to the point where I was nine days late. I should have had my period about the 17th, and this came to the night of the 26th. I went to Target, and I got a pregnancy test. Not the first time I've done that, and every single time I've ever done it, I came back with a negative result. <sighs> I, I want to, like, talk about this story in depth, but, like, my arm is killing me from holding this thing because I'm actually holding my um, iPod while I do this. But long story short, I got a positive result. However, as I've told people, I feel like I'm in a dream right now. And here he comes. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> 
but I feel like I'm in a dream right now until an expert tells me officially, oh yeah, girl, yeah, okay. And then that's when I'm going to be able to like, you know, fully, you know, get into it like, oh my God, yes, you know, all that. But um, I'm super happy and super anxious and I'm going to murder him and <laughs> that's it. He's a jerk. <laughs> Thank you for listening. I appreciate it. And, well, listening, watching, whatever. Take care. Bye.